There's been a lot of discussion these days about the tight financial relationship between China and the United States. Well, at this rice shop in Hong Kong, I thought I'd take the opportunity to explain to you exactly what's at stake in this relationship. This jar represents the amount of debt or treasuries the U.S. had to issue in 2006 in order to finance its budget deficit. This rice represents China's money. One grain is the equivalent of 5 million U.S. dollars. So in 2006, the Chinese lent the United States about this much, half. So let's talk now about 2008. The U.S. had to issue a lot more treasuries to finance its ballooning budget deficit. China bought about this much. So China bought three times more. It's a smaller percentage of the overall whole, but take a look at how much more debt the U.S. has. That's why the U.S. government is looking for buyers wherever they can find them, and China has a whole lot of cash. So why would China need to buy U.S. debt? Well, China has a lot of U.S. dollars from all its exports, and it needs a safe place to park those dollars and watch them grow. It's within China's interest to keep feeding the U.S. economy and help it grow so that Americans can be happy and well-fed and buy more Chinese goods.